Hey everybody, welcome to our channel Adventures in Second Life and this is a little series that I'm going to do on an adventure I'm about to embark on. It's me Jazz, just hanging out and I'm going to bring you guys along with me on my little adventure because I've only been here for five months and I already have a ridiculous amount of inventory items. And I'm a visual person and I want to be able to see them. I don't want a bunch of folders with no pictures. I need pictures in my life. So I decided that I was going to try out the CTS wardrobe, which will give me pictures and do all kinds of stuff. So that's the adventure that I'm going to go on. <laughs> so if you guys want to use the wardrobe, you can follow along with me. I have to give a shout out to Buttercup Princess because... I have watched all of Butta's tutorials multiple times trying to figure out how to do this thing and they're extremely helpful so I will throw a link down in the show notes so that you guys can check those out too. But again, this is just me trying to learn how to do this wardrobe thing and maybe you guys will learn from my mistakes and I'm sure I'll have some awesomeness in there too. But you can learn from my mistakes and not do the same things that I have done or am about to do. All right, so what's the first thing we need to do? First thing we need to do is to go to Marketplace and we need to buy the wardrobe. So I'm going to type in CTS wardrobe. Dun, da, da, da. And there it is CTS wardrobe. That's the one we want $6.99 Lindens. So this is what you are looking for to buy. And I know that 699 Linden seems like a lot of money, but with the current conversion rates, it's only $2.18 in U.S. currency. Just saying. So it's not as bad as you think it is. When I first got here and I looked at Linden's, I thought, oh my gosh, that's a lot of money. Not really. So if you got $3, you can get the wardrobe. Just saying, if you're in the U.S. All right, so this is what you want to add to your cart and purchase, and then I'll show you what it looks like after it gets to you. All right, so let's open up the inventory. And I have already searched my inventory. Look, y'all, 24,512 items. That's ridiculousness. I know it is. It's okay. I have a little shopping problem. I'm not, you know, too ashamed to admit it. I'll own it. I own my shopping problem. But here is the wardrobe. So you should have a folder. Actually, you're going to have a little box like this. And then you're going to unpack this. And when you get the folder open, we have custom display board, which we don't need to worry about. Help. Everybody needs a little help. There's your manuals. And then some cards. But the main things we're going to deal with right now is this wardrobe HUD right here and then this closet version 2.8 that's the actual wardrobe that we can res out in world to actually use so this is what I'm gonna do <laughs> that's what it looks like okay um, I'm gonna end this video because we just wanted to buy it and then see what comes in the folder we're going to do this baby step in. We're going to baby step, y'all. So baby step with me. All right. So in the next video, we'll get some things set up that we need in order to use this wardrobe in Second Life. All right. Peace out to the next video.